Hello guys, new day, new episode is coming again, so today again we are playing with Levante and we are playing, we are starting with home game against Leganes who is fighting for relegation. So I'm expecting three points, I'm at home, my tactic is really strong at home and uh, I'm doing a lot of clean sheets at least at home, so definitely. I'm expecting maybe 2-0 results for me. So I'm currently 7 points behind Barcelona and the biggest upset was my last game where I lost against Valladolid with that stupid penalty in the extra time. And uh, so it will be still hard to catch Barcelona, especially they are not dropping a lot of points, but there is still hope. Uh, just now I was checking Barcelona's schedule, they need to play against Atletico Madrid, against Real Madrid and against me in away game. Me, I need to play only against uh, Real Madrid in away game. So there is still hope. And there is also one more important thing. Uh, so goal difference doesn't matter in Spanish league, it's results between team is mandatory. So I defeated Barcelona 2-1 I think in a way game. So if we have same amount of points, uh, I can win the title. I will have, uh, I will be better on the table. So definitely there is still some hope. But for now most important is at least to keep keep pressure on them and I need to beat teams like Leganes, uh, I don't know, Valladolid and these this smaller teams I need, I need to not drop any more points. For now Leganes looks better than me by possession, but on shoots on the targets, I have 6 shots on the target, no yellow cards. I hear some chat, fuck it, I need to close him. Kids all the time. No luck in this situation. Yesterday for me, excellent day on for betting. I mean, a lot of money earned. So you can see everything on my uh, Twitter account. What I won yesterday, he missed. Uh, I was really sure that Leipzig will win just because Leipzig plays attacking football and I was expecting that Mourinho will just stay behind ball and try to counter attack. Uh, I don't know who is even paying this amount of money to this type of the coaches. Not only that, the club is also, Tottenham is doing very poor de uh, deals. Uh, for example, nobody can tell me that uh, this uh, Fernandez midfielder is worth 40 million. <laughs> no chance. Or uh, Davison Sanchez also 40. They all, all these players are played, uh, they paid them overpriced, definitely. So, I don't know. I really don't know. What to do now? I'm... I'm almost in the finish of the match. I still didn't score the goal. What? Okay, okay, I'm happy with this one. If the wing back scores like this goals, very good for me. The only three points matters in this game. My players are basically dying. Some kind of ping pong, but again go. Ping pong, ping pong. I didn't check my schedule, but if I remember from yesterday, we need to play against smaller teams in this episode. Because I already played all against bigger, and I think it's almost half season, maybe one, two games more.
I think we also need to play that cup game. Cup, cup competition is starting and I think we are playing against smaller teams so I'm not sure we will manage to play 4-5 games I mean league games maybe some cup games will be here also but we will try to to play cup games with uh, only commentary no replays no nothing I just want to go very fast with this game and, uh, I would like also that in game that there is option that cup games are managed by uh, assistant manager, but there is no. Of course, I will try to rotate as many as pos as much as possible. I also forget it now. Uh, I have one more central defender for rotation. If I can find him, he is. He was uh, injured for four or five months, so definitely I can push him up. So regarding January transfer window, <laughs> maybe I will try to loan one more striker, but it needs to be good one. Very important message. So only 55% from transfer revenue, so that means definitely I will not sell nobody from this squad I don't I don't think so maybe only with option that he leaves at the end of the season and they give me money now but how is Barcelona again they won no chance one two even Granada was leading As I said million times, assistant manager is very very important. If you're playing like me, this type of play style, and uh, with his high motivation, he, he will be perfect for your teams. And definitely Valderrama is what this guy wants. You can leave if you want, I don't care, but uh, th maybe not now, maybe at the end of season, yes, for now, maybe no. But I still need him for some uh, for some rotations if needed, especially in the cup game, he can play in the cup. Going souls, going souls. Today, European League games. I must say, I was just now checking. I didn't feel that. I don't see any clear favorite in some. Of, at least for now, until I don't see lineups, I don't recommend betting on these games for today. There are some basketball games that I am interested to invest some money, but uh, we will see about that one. So, cup games, so who can play? One, two, three, basically everybody from bench. Even goalkeeper I can change. I will add him some shitty number. So we will change no replace and only commentary. I don't I'm not interested to watch this game. Nice, 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 nice.
This is what I would like to see when I see that everything is green. That means I want some money again, so... Not bad, only 7 goals in half time, not, not so bad. Zero ten, excellent. So Abelardo is sucked from, is it correct, from Espanol and now I'm playing with Espanol. So we have some kind of winter break now. 17 days. Spanish Cup second round draw. Let's hope I will have luck and just play with low quality teams in this cup. Okay, very good low quality team, very good draw. If I remember correctly, in this Spanish Cup Bilbao is, I think they are, a lot of times they won this competition, I think, maybe even the most, 
I don't remember now, but they are always good in this cup. I hate when is this big break between the matches it's going very fast as I said I am really interested if somebody can make skin where I can go directly to match day that would be really nice So for the next year, what is the projection? For next year, I need to sign one striker, one central defender, and maybe they need to be top players. Then I need to sign one player who can play, who is good as Mezala and who can play also as deep line playmaker. So he needs to have decent uh, work rate, maybe some tackling. Plus long shot, must be very good all around player, so it is not easy to find that kind of player, but okay, more or less. So these three players I need to sign, maybe I need to extend loan of Mayoral for one year more, because I think he is very decent third option striker, just because he is Spanish and I need to have some Spanish. Then I need maybe to sign on free one Spanish goalkeeper for bench. And uh, that's it. I think that is all what I need to be very competitive in the next year. Regarding the wing backs, may probably no. I will not have money. So that's it. I don't know from the Spanish players who I'm really interested. I don't see any good one what I like. Except Olmo. Olmo always like, but we are playing with latest database keys in the Leipzig, so I don't have enough money for him definitely. Espanol away. This will not be easy game, definitely. Espanol has very decent team. And my last game I didn't play quite well at home. Even I won convincingly, I mean, with clean sheet, but I was not happy. So this game is all about my defense. If defense is good, defensive approach then I will win in 99% of the matches maybe it can happen again same game with 0-0 until X time and then penalty for them like that by the Dolly game but that is very very rarely to see I think I done mistake with when I changed to very attacking in that game I did it just to keep it and take the point very attacking mentality to change in a way game I think it's always a mistake for home, okay, but in away games, very you will be. Feel. So transfer revenue is now fifty five percent, not good. I mean, I don't have maybe to sell. Maybe I can sell only Radoya and one more, but. Uh, as I said, I need them for rotation, 
until end of this year so I don't think so I will go and now spend some time looking for new youngster who can fix up we will see uh, for now no I don't think so Caleri I really don't know I can score my playing after Espanol maybe cup game again because I saw the draw was maybe one uh, first division game then cup game something like that to charge my phone my phone is always on and I already broke the screen and everything few times because even it's now already few years I have it it's still uh, still working very good that's why the reason I didn't want to change it but definitely definitely now it released this new new Samsung what was released a few days ago I think I will buy that shit it's even will be very expensive but Finally, I think is it it is worth to, to replace it. Hmm. End of season. Sorry, non negative. I think I will add this one just to see to see our votes. Yeah, this episode looks very boring. Bye. He can be unhappy, whatever he likes, but I don't care for his opinion. That is the only thing what I like from Ferguson. He was really the boss. Even for me, actually, tactically, and uh, for me, he was not a great manager. I mean, they won only one Champions League with him, but it's, in my opinion, very poor. Also, um, he was not, I mean, never mind, he was dominant in the Premiership, but worldwide, they won only one Champions League. With that kind of squad, what was he was having? Not really impressive, definitely for me. He was good, but if people asking me if he was one of the best managers ever, no chance. I think he was not even best British manager. Let's say I know that he's Scottish, so the Liverpool managers was much better. I mean, they won more uh, Champions League than him. But uh, definitely I like from him uh, his attitude. What is this? Chinese? No. End of season. He can go, I don't care for it. 
Yeah, so Espanol, then I see Spanish Cup away game. Away, away. Looks like everything same, I will confirm. Zero. So uh, away tactic. Uh, let's put all these my standard players back to play. We can go on the bench. No, Veza is playing here. Sorry. That's it. Away tactic for away game. Standard lineup. Let's start. Oof, 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 oof. I need to return back these things. So Espanol looks uh, they will not defend in this game. They started with very looks like a bit attacking approach. Come on! Fuck it, uh, entire half time, no highlight. I have already bad feeling about this game. Nice tackle, come on now! Pass! Cross pass, whatever. He saved. Perfect cross in Torodon. He didn't score. I don't know. Will I replace Badri? I mean, Badri is my best set piece taker and uh, the guy who can score from outside. What kind of goal is this? Never mind. At least he's in. It's goal. Uh, it's goalkeeper error. Let's. Uh, I have three subs, so actually we can leave the time. Let's let's wait until 80, and then I will just do three subs one by one. Let's, let's now do for sub uh, who will I replace. Yeah, this guy with. First sub. Then I will do one more sub. For another Mezala. I don't have any striker on bench, I think. Pass. He missed. Concentrate. 
I think I will do now one more sub just after this highlight. Uh, he's only valid option for now from the bench. So this is the situation when they are when are you using the subs to reach the time. Not very nice, it's cornered so time will go. Ah, very nice screen there. Tackle him like that. Let's hope he cannot score from this range. Who is shooting? Raul de Tomas. Very nice shot. Very, very nice. And again, 0 1 with clean sheet. Perfect result. Yeah, I'm, I'm uh, worse than Mourinho. Definitely. Real won. Now 8 games, 8 days until next game. Pretty decent time. So he's suspended for next first division game. Valladolid Barcelona. Valladolid is 13 on the table. Come on, one draw. 0-0, zero, zero, please. Yeah, definitely that Valladolid defeat was really fucked me. Oh my god, they won. They won. This Valladolid is like dark horse in this uh, in this division. So I'm only for with Blas. Ah, no, no. Improve on the training fact. How is my uh, division schedule now? So I played uh, away against this spell. Maybe now I need to play some home games finally. All the time playing away, away, away. At least the, these cup games are uh, not every two, three days. My schedule is not so tight for now. But this fucking Atletico Madrid is still upon me. And I, I even forgetting about them, you know. But they are playing Champions League, you know, let's go. So, Celta at home. Celta fifth on the table. Fifth on table, Celta. I forget to check is there any good striker to be loaned. Poor composure, that not good. No any face. 
dead player. So for now looks like no any transfers for me. Actually now next game I will play just with home tactic. They are very small sides so pure attack. One, two, three. Okay, four days. But Ooh, Celta then Sevilla. Fuck, fuck, fuck. At least I'm playing at home, but these are dangerous things, you know? And uh, only a few days. Two days rest only. Maybe I will need to rotate in these games. So the cup games I need to rotate as much as possible. These two we will see. Okay, again, same, same things. Bruno. Robert. Ah, this guy is also ready to play, finally. Goalkeeper. How long? One to five days. Okay, at least I will have some backup in case for striker. So we will do the same thing, only commentary and uh, no any replays, just to speed up these things. I'm losing against this team. There is possibility of red cards, so I need to replace both of them. Let's try like this. Ot Maybe it's the better that I just drop out from competition and finish story. Maybe that's the best option for everybody. No, I will not push for the cup. Fuck the cup. Better I don't play it anymore. Is it extra time? Penalty is alright, I need to play one more game. They have red card. Extra kickoff. Okay, then we will try to win it. What I can say to you. Who will I replace? Uh, one of the wing backs. Definitely I'm disappointed that I needed to beat them in the extra time. Even actually by statistic you see they have only one shot on the target and they scored the goal. 
Yesterday was really interesting, uh, the game between Aberdeen and is it was Kilmarnock or something like that. I mean, two, three goals in extra time, I think. Uh, Scottish Cup. Okay, I won, but I'm not happy. Do I have time to play one more? Maybe even these two. We will try to speed up. Actually, I'm a little bit delayed with this campaign. I was expecting to finish this one until tomorrow, but looks like no chance. Some bullshit, I don't want to even. Mallorc. At least I'm playing at home. Oh my god. Vigo home, Sevilla home, Mallorca home. Every third day game. Very tough schedule. Very, very tough. Do I have any suspension? I think Badri is suspended for this uh, Vigo game. How long? How long? I didn't check. Out of day. Of course, use Club Doctor. Who are these people? That is Barcelona. Osasuna. Osasuna is bottom, so they will win this one definitely. For one, they won, so. Come on, I need to take six points from these two home games. Okay, let's uh, put all these players back to action from Beltran here. Vesa here. Sorry, Radon, you need to play. Uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, situation is not ideal, but we need to show some character and die on field. Did I put the home tactic or I fuck up? Let me check. No, I didn't. I need to return this one, I need to return this one and I need to change to home Yeah, Celta with Jaspas and this Mina they can be dangerous Bradaric, this is uh, my player here from Peru from split come on come on let's go early so now we are in the in january so these new players like max and this polish guy they will be much better because Six months they pass for adoption, so I think they will improve now. Even they will be even better in the second half of the season. That's a lot of time happens with the player, you know. After 
game turns in January, they become better. The, the players what you signed in the in the summer transfer window. Shoot! Boom! Boom! He saved. Offside, I think. I have already four shots on the target. Come on, I need to score before half time. Almost, almost. Good combo, good pass for him. Very poor header. At least for now looks that I'm completely controlling the game. Come on. Dribble him. Cross. Again, some offside. No goal. Yellow, what he played with hand? Come on now, counter, pass directly to, to black guy. Yeah, definitely I'm pushing but no goal. Very good uh, cross again. I think I will put Elmas instead of this uh, Melero in the second half. Maybe he can score goal. Come on! Go for penalty. Ha! What is Jaspas is playing as midfielder? Look where he is. They are doing fucking tick attack against me now. Look. Steal the ball. Come on. Counter. Run. 
Run, run, run. Good delivery, please. Not so bad delivery, but they broke. I can tell you guys, I was really dominating, but you see how what kind of goal I scored. Need one more to close the game. Come on, Amo. Nice pass. Game over. So I need I need to do some changes in the squad. Let's try save this guy. And then 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 one of the wing backs I need to replace. This guy needs some playing time, so the reason is I need to play the new game after 2-3 days. Do not concede the goal now when I that changes. Do not concede. Block. Excellent. Come on, block. Calm down. I think we will do one more episode. I will do Sevilla and then I can end of episode and I can do just for fun this Mallorca game and I will not even record it. It's cup game so I don't care. The good thing is I'm playing at home so we will rotate as much as possible. Come on, one more goal. Again, very, very ping pong passing from Beltran. Yeah, definitely, this was the, my best buy to buy this guy. Tonelli is also perfect as this in this role. Maybe even slightly better. Why? Right, they scored. No clean sheet. No clean sheet. I need to go with. Uh, where is this? Concentrate. I hope I will not concede one more. Do not lose the ball. <laughs> Take it. To who? To who he pass? Look this guy, look this shit. Yeah, they definitely this intelligence of defenders is disaster in this game. Luckily for me they didn't score the goal. So all these things are not related to tactic, it's just main changing his shit, that's the thing. Offside, must be offside, I think. Come on. Tick attack. 
canal, do not close the ball. Ah, he can cry whatever he wants. Most important, I won. Barcelona also won. No luck. Sevilla home, Mallorca, Cup, then Alaves. Away. Yeah, definitely we will do Sevilla game and then uh, I will end of this episode. What they want immediately? No, not immediately end of the season Barcelona, Valencia, come on, draw, draw, at least draw. Come on, Valencia. Atletico Madrid won again, but they are also pushing hard. And Barcelona won. So Badri will return now. Home tactic, yeah. I don't need this guy on the bench. Some of my players dropped in, in form in last five games like this Rokina. Come on, come on. Come on, early goal, early goal. Bomb, bomb. It's the corner, come on. Yeah, 
yeah, mistake by uh, Sevilla defender. And actually a really nice goal from this Mayoral. Very good, come on. I don't want to end the episode again with the defeat, like last one. Yeah, they have this fucking soul, so he can uh, he can score from these set pieces definitely, and, and uh, from outside. This uh, this Polish guy is tackling all the time. You need to replace him at half time. Come on, one more goal. Shoot! Boom! Boom! Yeah. Very good bombarding. Need second goal to kill the game. Again, very nice delivery, but no goal. I think I need to have a private. What the fuck is this? Where is my defense? Where is goalkeeper? Look at this goal. Hi, hi. I need to have this private talk with Rokina. He's underperforming. Like Sevilla is now a different team in the second half. Look at this. Come on. Come on, fast! Navas is went. He went up. Yeah, okay, this guy is not having a lot of pace. <laughs> yeah, but. Uh, I need to do. I need to do two changes. This left side, I, I expected more things, so... Come on! To who? To who? To keep it? He saved it. Yeah, this goalkeeper is actually really good. Something is vibrating when I hit this fucking screen. Looks like I dropped home points. Maybe even I will lose the game. I'm not playing second half quite well.
Come on, dribble him. Corner. Yes. So important goal. Goal. Definitely. Definitely with four points. If I keep this four points pace. Excellent pass, excellent goal, excellent counter attack. I don't know, something is vibrating after I hit this, this keyboard and everything. <laughs> Okay, no, no more. Come on. Offside. So, this will be end of this episode guys, as you can see only 4 points I am behind, so I, I still have good, good chances to win the title. Uh, I mean I need to play also at home with Barcelona and Atletico Madrid. So only I am going to play away game against Real. So everything is on me, I, I, I have feeling I can push for the title, especially if I am avoiding if I avoid injuries, definitely. So regarding the cup game, uh, now we need to play against Mallorca, so I will not record this one, I'm not sure. I will, I will rotate, if we lose, we lose. That's it. So, thanks for watching and see you maybe tonight or tomorrow. Bye.